Ladies and gentlemen, welcome back to another first Celtic preview of the season and not one I'm I'm drawing going into because um out of the Champions League qualifiers again, um y again you can't you, this season you can't blame it on the manager because he's been thrown in in, a, in circumstances where the board have just thrown him in and left him with us to pick up somehow. Um Starfelt is in the build, uh, in the building uh, at Celtic Park. Um he will be fit for Saturday. Um Celtic confirmed that, but um, but the main point I want to talk about is Hearts can easily beat us. I mean, Mitchell and but last night were there for the taking, and we never took it. And you know, you could point at various points of the game where you know Forrest could have made it two 0 and then you know it was game set and match. But you don't take your chances; you pay for them, and Celtic did and. Not only that, the performance going into the extra time was absolutely atrocious. I mean, Ange Postecoglou at his bench, and you know what we got. We have nothing. We have youngsters who, Dane Murray, eighteen. What's he supposed to do? Making his bloody debut in the Champions League qualifiers? What? His senior day. I don't. I. I don't, that's just embarrassing. That's utterly atrocious that you've got to put an eighteen-year-old in defence with Wales. You know what I mean? As well, as well. Do you know what I mean? But we already talked about. Hearts versus Celtic, first game of the season, I was at Time Castle. I'm doing this video on Thursday because tomorrow I'm going to Blackpool for the weekend. Thank God for that. I don't have to deal for Celtic for the weekend, but I will be doing a few things while in video, guys, in hotel. So uh, I'll still be covering it, guys, for you. So make sure you have notifications on that video. Um, but if you're enjoying the video so far, make sure to like and subscribe. Um, Hearts Celtic, uh, what can I say? It's been. Over the years, it's been, you know, one of the times thrashings for Hearts, you know, Celtic winning a lot. The one I can remember, Verbo, is the, when Brendan Rodgers first came in, um, it was first, actually, yeah, the first game of the season, uh, pretty sure it was 2016-17 season, the invincible season, I think, I'm sure, pretty sure. Um, Scott Sinclair came, came on and made his debut, the rest is history there. Score the winner, 2-1 Celtic. Now, you know, I can be optimistic as I can about you know, Celtic on Saturday against Hearts, but I said this when I was very worried for Celtic on Tuesday night, you know, about Champions and qualifiers and, you know, it proved me right, it, I was right. Um, you know, any good team in Hearts aren't a mug team, they're, they're, they're you know, they're good, I mean, I mean, um, you know, some may say, you know, they were unlucky to go down last season where they, they were managed maybe, say, last season, so, um, you know, two seasons ago, sorry, when they went down to the Championship, but, so, Hearts aren't any other you know, farmers team, you know, they're that you're there they're there and they're gonna they're gonna press you and they're gonna do the same thing but more worse than Richland because I feel hearts are gonna take their chances on Saturday and Celtic with a defence of Stephen Welsh and supposedly so Carol Starfield, you know, making his debut, I mean just thrown in like bloody and post coglu you know you know, if he does make a mistake, Carl Starfield it'll be over the it'll be everywhere and it'll be it, the worst possible start. I mean, I, I best of luck to Carl Starfield. I hope he does well on Saturday. But, but Christ, if we start with us line up Stephen Welsh and Dane Murray, because I, you know, I'm not surprised. I'm not, you know, I don't think Ange Postecoglou will start. But if he does, if he doesn't, sorry, we've got a bloody line up of a back four of a back. So goalkeeper, you know, put Barkas, the bloody guy, or Bain, because they don't. Even if they had super glue in their hands, they couldn't save a ball. They couldn't. They honestly couldn't. The 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 goal the goal Michelin scored last night. The header or whatever it was, Bain. My Christ. First point. He should have went out for the ball. It was, it was a goalkeeper's ball all day long. And then second way. How's he not saving it near post? That's, that's atrocious. That one. Um, you know, Barkas. You know, my Christ. He's already conceded six, um, six plus goals already this season. He's not even started the bloody you know actual season. Oh, I, I don't believe it. But it's come to this, so I, it doesn't really matter who's in goal Saturday because we'll still concede. Um, a back four of Ralston, Taylor, uh, Welsh, and Murray. Yep, came to this. Uh, it's absolutely atrocious you've come to bloody Ralston, Welsh, um, Dane Murray, and Greg Taylor at the back. It is absolutely, they couldn't even get a team, they couldn't not get in a bloody. They couldn't even get in a start in 11 for Ross County, say. They would never. I mean, it's absolutely atrocious. I mean, midfield last night, the, some pe some players tried the hardest, but Edward, my Christ, how did he stay in the park? I have no idea. That long. I mean, just take a, just to put a Yeti on for Edward, he wasn't doing it. And I mean, I know Turnbull might be tired, but 
you know, at least, you know, if you take Edward off, you know, I don't know, man. He wasn't even worth 18 pence last night. My Christ. Um, but I can be optimi optimistic as I can, but I've, my hearts are going to... Yep. You, you got to win the Saturday Celtic to get the best off of chances of doing something this season, but the way it's going, you know, Ange Postecoglou needs a whole bloody new team, to be honest with you. Um, I see it. It's Hearts winning Saturday. I really do. I don't see us winning at all. Um... <laughs> Because Hearts won't let Celtic have those bloody... See Bain with the ball trying to do bloody like his name are. But he's a goalkeeper. He's supposed to keep the ball out the net. No, pick it out the net. My God. The amount of times, man, I he nearly had a heart attack last night watching him just do that. I mean, how can you do that? You're in a Champions League qualifier, not a pre-season or a, a daft, um, you know, just a, a friendly game. You're not. And we were playing this... Uh, I'm not surprised if Celtic get beat after this team, F FK Jabernick, that's who we face next Thursday the 5th of August in the in the, in the Czech Republic, we all remember that, the Czechs, eh, oof, um, you know, um, yeah, it's like it's Spar Prague, 4-1 twice, yep, I'm not surprised if Jabernick beat us because that's where the standards have came because, you know, we've came to this level every season now and it's absolutely you know, I've made this video twice this, you know, the, you know what I mean? But, as I say, guys, I've discussed a few things about, you know, what I can expect on Saturday. I expect Hearts to beat us, Hearts to beat, Hearts to beat us easily. Um, you know, it might be a good game, but I think Hearts will beat us anyway. Um, we might score, but I don't see us winning. Uh, I don't see us clipping the clean sheet either. So, yeah. <laughs> That's it, guys. If you have enjoyed it, please subscribe and like, share the video as per usual. Um been in a state of like well bloody we're, the Titanic we're like the Titanic we're sinking here we're absolutely sinking into the, the ocean here because my Christ we're at defence on Saturday we'll block you if we get a draw at that, that rate at this rate <laughs> yep I'll see you guys in the next video very shortly